We're going back to the moon. Well, at least the United States is. You've probably heard that a great big rocket has been launched towards our lunar neighbour. Here are 10 things you need to know about NASA's latest project. One, it's called Artemis. The original moon missions were named Apollo after the sun god of Greek mythology. And Apollo's twin sister, in both mythology and now space travel, is called Artemis. Two, the Artemis space program will land people on the moon for the first time in over 50 years, including the first woman and the first person of colour. Three, that's how many missions are currently on the cards. Artemis 1 launches now, Artemis 2 from 2024, and Artemis 3 from 2025. Four, each mission has a different objective. Artemis 1 is an uncrewed flight around the moon. Two will be crewed and three will land them on the surface of the moon. Five, it will use the world's most powerful rocket to launch. It's capable of generating the force of nearly four million kilograms of thrust, so don't get caught underneath it. Six, astronauts will cruise around in the Orion spacecraft, which has three modules and new launch abort technology that protects the crew if something goes wrong during takeoff. Seven, the plan is to eventually build a moon base to conduct research and keep astronauts on the surface for longer periods. Eight, while Artemis 1 won't carry humans, there are three mannequins or moonikins, which will be used to provide sensor feedback to NASA. Nine, they'll also be joined by some mascots, including Snoopy, Shaun the Sheep, and four Lego mini figurines. 10, Mars. Artemis is a program that will help NASA plot a route to send humans to Mars, but not for a few years yet.